Hey there friends and enemies, Joper here again and today we got the official next entry in the Legend of Zelda franchise, Tears of the Kingdom. I am very excited to check this out. Obviously Breath of the Wild is an all-time game and I can't wait to see more in this franchise. Everyone's been waiting for it. They've been expecting Breath of the Wild 2, but instead we're getting Tears of the Kingdom, which is going to be the sequel or at least the successor to Breath of the Wild. So I'm very excited about that. We get a release date, which is surprising considering we hadn't really gotten a lot of information on this game previously, but I can't wait. Let's check out the trailer and I'll give my thoughts afterwards. Nintendo did a great job of dropping games and trailers that are coming soon with release dates, which I thought was awesome. Nintendo Direct today was fantastic. Okay. All right, yeah, we're in here. You can definitely see the Breath of the Wild vibes in this gameplay already. Tears of the Kingdom. Five twelve, twenty twenty three. So we know obviously this is dropping sooner than later in may of next year which is very exciting i think a lot of people have been looking forward to this game we didn't get a lot of information in this direct but we did get the release date which means we know there will be additional coverage coming up in the not so distant future i would expect early next year after octopath traveler and fire emblem have released that's when they'll go heavy with the marketing for legend of zelda and we're going to see gameplay and trailers and all that kind of good stuff. I think everyone who has played Breath of the Wild is really highly anticipating the next game in this franchise. It looks like it's going to carry on similar gameplay, probably the same story path that we would have expected from Breath of the Wild. So I, I just I think I'm blown away by the fact that they not only have announced the game but also have a release date and it's not over a year away you know a lot of games these days can be dropped uh with cinematic trailers cgi all that kind of stuff and we don't know when the game is is launching we'll have a long window between when it's officially revealed the title is revealed all that kind of good stuff but until we get the actual firm release and announcement. So knowing it's coming in May is very, very exciting. We've got so many RPGs and awesome games to look forward to from September all the way through May of next year, which as a fan of RPGs myself, I am thrilled with because I think there's just so much potential and all these games are going to have something different to add. There's Final Fantasy games, there's Zelda, we've got Octopath Traveler, all that kind of stuff. So I think they did a fantastic job. Switch, uh, Nintendo at this Direct dropped some amazing, amazing announcements. If you haven't checked them out already, I'm covering all the games on the channel that I am looking forward to. So definitely check out the other videos. As far as this game, what I want to see... I really want to see them expand upon the features that we love from Breath of the Wild and maybe take some additional risks with either combat or abilities and weapons uh, or simply the story. If they, they take some risks with the story and do some things that people are not expecting. I think this trailer didn't tell us a whole lot on what's going to happen with Tears of the Kingdom, but we already know kind of what to expect and... I, I don't think you have to sell many people on the fact that this is going to be the next Zelda game. Either they're going to 
want to play the game already, they've played Breath of the Wild and they're in, or it's not for them and then you can move on. But for that reason, I don't think you have to really spoil too much. And I'm hoping that this game is full of unique ideas, unique uh, abilities, all that kind of good stuff. Anyway, if you enjoyed the video, hit that like button. Make sure you subscribe to the channel. I'm going to cover this game and then all the RPGs coming to Switch and PlayStation and Steam, all that kind of good stuff going forward. So definitely stay tuned and check all of that out. Let me know in the comments down below. Is this a day one must buy for you? Are you excited about Tears of the Kingdom or still wait and see mode? Anyway, I hope you have a good one. My name is Jopa and I'll catch you all later.